<coughs> let's uh, let's let's take a little bit of value through this. It's going to go up in voltage, in amperage, a lot more than the other one. So uh, 15 volts. Okay. We're almost equal amps. 1.7. Um, 2.4 now onto 19 volts. So we look see what we get off this. Oh. Not bad. Not bad. Let's get a bit more welly. We're 19 volts. That oil we're having 22, 23. Uh, that's, oh, that's 24. Let's go down a little bit. So we're on 3 amps, just over 3 amps, 22.5 volts. Now, I've been told a few times that I shouldn't take these chips. Sort of uh, in one of my circuits. When I was quizzing somebody about why like, it kept popping the transistor, they said it's because I was going above 14 volts. That does it, so let's just go up a little time bit more. Uh, what we've got now, we've got 20, 23, 24. So, it's not bad. Not bad, not bad. Let's just whip that down a second. Quick little heat test on the uh, ah, it's not even touching it. Let's turn it back up again. Okay, that's uh, so about 27 25. Oh, I like the gap that you can get there. <laughs> Let's turn up a bit more. Uh, I don't know. Oh, that's 28 volts. So I've never taken it as high as this before, so I expect it's just going to get bang any second. Okay, oh, that's pretty good. So I wonder if we can go full blast. There we go. That's actually taken it over its limit. So I'm just trying to limit that to 5 amps. Yeah, that's pretty good. Oh, I got that down, so we don't want to damage it. Okay, time to damage the device. Quick little heat check. Um, okay, if it was a cup of tea, you might drink it, because it was still warm enough, or you might just tip it and make yourself a new one. That's how warm that's got, but, you know, that's not running that for any real length of time, but it's 